a man named Austin decided to tell the uh, half a billion dollar quarterback of the Kansas City Chiefs that he was a bum and then went on to tell him that Justin Herbert is better than him. So Patrick Mahomes in a state of defense in a verbal joust after being called a bum by a bum, a sent fired something back, okay, and said, uh, I think what he meant to say and what he actually said, we get it, same concept, but it is definitely a talking point. Can we run this video, please? You're a bum. Watch out for Justin Herbert next year. Yep. Don't care. Okay, that boy awesome. Proving yeah. you're a big Chargers fan. We like it. I mean, I thought the American Central Championship was supposed to be a good time. Okay, I thought time was had. Patrick Mahomes gets attacked after hitting a 347-yard carry drive and steal the show a couple of different times out there. Uh, then he went on to say, you know, uh, I'll see it when I believe it or whatever. He'll believe it when he sees it is what he meant there with Justin Herbert. Ricochet shot for Herbert there as Patrick Mahomes, I think, was attempting to bury said guy who called him a bum. Uh, I think that's real, though. You know, Justin Herbert has all of the pieces. Last year, he played unbelievable. Uh, he has a chance to be the I, a guy, the guy, whatever the hell he wants to be. But after one year, a little bit too much hype. Maybe that's what Patrick Mahomes meant. Maybe Patrick Mahomes just meant to say, fuck you to this one guy. But this is being talked about on the internet all of a sudden, AJ. I mean, okay, so that's my first time seeing it. That I would assume Patrick Mahomes is just speaking directly to this guy that called him a bum to his face. Like, he's not... He didn't, he's not even thinking about Justin Herbert in this comment. He's probably trying to censor himself all at the same time and not say what he really wants to say to this dude. Bingo. And it's a very fast moment where you are caught on camera. And from the way you've described, it is a very positive atmosphere over there. Everybody loves everybody. How you doing? Keep it moving. So I, I, I just don't want people to think that, I mean, maybe there is. I don't know. Same division. Oh, so yeah. the, maybe there is, but the internet was trying to cook up some real, you know, Patrick Mahomes is jealous of Justin Herbert or he doesn't like it. It was like, whoa, 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 whoa. What about a guy just being caught off guard and trying to bury a motherfucker in front of everybody? I mean, what are we what are we doing here? I don't think that's the real thing, but I guess we'll see. Hey, we'll keep an eye on it as we go forward. Yeah, for sure. Well, I mean, with Vegas and Denver, like you can't really see them holding the candle to the Chiefs. Really, it is just the Chargers. Like that is probably going to be the rivalry in that division for the next, you know, 10 years. Casual, by the way, by Patrick Mahomes. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, we'll see. Kind of, uh, yeah, we'll see. Yeah. We're pretty good still. Well, I mean, Justin Herbert, this, I think he knows. Like, there are, they have put massive expectations on Justin Herbert because he had such a great year his first year. But didn't they have to rebuild their whole O-line? Yeah, yeah, but I think Staley going over there is a big deal. Yeah. It's great. I mean, I think it's, it's going to work out for him. I think Herbert is going to be a stud for a long time. But I think this year, like, if there's any bumps in the road, people are going to freak out probably. And not, I mean, is it this year people are expecting? I think it gets another year with the new head coach. I, I think it's either this year or next year they're going to expect things because this year you can say new offense, yeah. new pieces, new head coach. They're still there, I think, you know. But the expectations on Herbert to perform are very high because of what he was able to do last year. And if they had any any situational awareness last year, they get at least two to three more wins. Yeah. I mean, there was numerous cases where there was the – you know, the lowest football IQ decisions were being made wrong. Like, there were wrong decisions being made. Now, I don't know if that's the coach's fault. He also told them they had no chance to make the playoffs when they still had a chance to make the playoffs. So I think they, they needed a fresh chapter in there. But everything Herbert has shown thus far is that he's going to be a guy. And the people I've talked to on the offensive side of the ball who have played against the Rams with Staley as the D coordinator there, they said, hey, this guy – yeah, he's a quarterback. It's a defense coordinator. This guy oh. is a real problem, and he's going to help out that Chargers defense. He's going to run some schemes of the defense. And then with Herbert, with a coach that is also a quarterback, you know, kind of on your side, I mean, there's a chance the Chargers could be a problem, but it's always going to be the big bad wolf in Kansas City. It's going to run that until uh, until told otherwise. Yeah, Derwin James coming back, too. Like that, if that team stays healthy, and they got uh, Lindsley from Green Bay yeah. to center, so they're really, they got some new pieces.